Hello dolls, welcome back to my channel. This is Ebony Nikita, your Dominican princess. And thank you dolls so much for joining me today in this episode. I will be giving you dolls some of the top five things that classy women never leave the house wearing. What are you leaving the house wearing? I know sometimes, oh, I just felt like a mom saying that. Where do you think you're going now? <laughs> but as classy ladies, we definitely want to make sure that what we are wearing presents us well. What we are wearing makes us feel good, make us feel confident. But we also want to make sure we're not giving off the bad impression. And these are just some pointers that I think you dolls will take away very, very nicely. And if you're not subscribed already, go ahead and subscribe to me, doll. I post every week and also don't forget to take a look at my blog where I do weekly posts. Okay dolls, let's go ahead and get started with this episode. One thing that a lady never ever ever leaves the house wearing is an outfit that shows too much skin. Goodness, this right here, it's harder during the summer spring type of season just because for me this is something that I have came to realize that I struggle with sometimes and it's not promiscuous or vulgar in any type of way of course it's just a very cute outfit to me and I've gone out the house wearing it before sometimes I'm looking I'm like <sighs> I, I asked my, my husband because whenever I came to see him and I came to Atlanta for a vacay and I seen him I was like, why did you let me leave the house wearing that? Oh my goodness, I was showing so much skin. And then he's like, oh, well, it was a cute outfit. You, you know, he has a Nigerian accent. So he's like, oh, it was a cute outfit. You, you know, I wasn't even thinking about that. Okay, that was actually Dominique. <laughs> I promise you, I do great impressions of him all of the time. But definitely, double check what you are wearing. So right now, I'm wearing this really, really cute top. I just want to make sure that because the top part of my outfit is showing my, more so of my chest area and my arms. I wanna make sure that the bottom part is complimenting. You don't ever wanna walk out the house showing too much. For one, you will most likely get more stares, a little bit more attention when you are showing much more skin and that's not always a good thing. And then the way that you almost portray yourself by the way that you dress, it counts, it actually matters because people talk to you differently. They speak to you differently, they approach you differently, especially for my single ladies out there. If you aren't showing too much skin and you have on a nice classy outfit, you will, there are still gonna be a couple of scrubs out there, but you will notice a different change in either how many men approach you or what type of men approach you. And that's something important. I mean, we can't control all of them. Obviously, we're beautiful ladies. <laughs> but you will definitely get a different type of crowd attention whenever you are dressing up a little bit more modest and a little bit more class. Okay, number two something a classy lady never leaves the house wearing. Unfit clothing, oh goodness, some of us ladies don't realize the impact of. Here is why it is important. When you are wearing unfit clothing, clothing that does not fit you well, clothing that's a little bit too baggy on you, or clothing that's a little bit too tight on you, it shows. Now, I get it, sometimes we just buy something, uh, maybe I can make this size work for me, but here's the thing, as a classy lady, as a feminine lady, you pay attention to details. So if something is a little bit too tight on you, you want to size up. And here is the reason why. When you are walking and you have on that gorgeous skirt, and for some reason, whenever you're walking, you have to keep on readjusting it, making sure that it doesn't go right up too much. That shows you don't want to feel that way when you are putting on clothing you want to feel confident in it because when you feel confident you look confident you look better you walk better you have a more enjoyable time when you're out take a day to just figure out what size you are and you should definitely do that for your undergarments too so any type of lingerie any type of bras definitely check that out oh my goodness that was so beautiful there's a red robin outside my neighborhood. It has so many beautiful red robins. Oh my gosh, I see the squirrel. Oh my, what, what does it have? Wow. Oh my goodness. 
Wow. Life is truly beautiful. It's just nice. Sometimes you have to stop and smell the roses and please excuse me, but that's what I just did. And it was very beautiful to see nature right there. Um, very peaceful. Mm, I feel at peace. Um, <laughs> on to my third point. Here is something else that a classy lady never leaves the house wearing, and that is too much accessories. This one, it isn't as severe, but I think sometimes we can overdo it. If we have a really, really cute outfit on, and then you throw on bracelets, then you throw on a necklace, then you throw on this, this, and this. And I completely get it. Sometimes some of us are just born to accessorize, <laughs> and I commend you on it. Some of us have a gift. And here is the thing. You do not want too many accessories because you don't want to be too much. You don't want to look too much too busy that's the perfect word you don't want to you don't want your outfit to look too busy because if your outfit is too busy guess what it's going to distract from you it's going to distract from you we are very beautiful women we don't need too much to look beautiful my tips to avoid over accessorizing go for timeless accessories simple as that so my fourth thing that a classy lady never leaves her house wearing would be the wrong clothing selection this right here is probably one of the biggest things i think overall it is one of the biggest things just the style of clothing that can overall deflect your overall appearance of looking classy feminine and elegant i will begin by giving you all some examples of just not very classy and elegant pieces that we all kind of have in our closet and maybe we shouldn't wear it as much if we want to have that classy and elegant appearance. So one of them would have to be hoodies, another one would have to be graphic tees, another one would have to be just flashy clothing, clothing that's a little bit too distracting. Those are just a couple of examples because I get it, you are going to the grocery store, you're running here, you're running there. Overall, as a classy and elegant woman, you want to be classy and elegant all of the time not just on instagram not just whenever you're seeing your family not just whenever you're trying to be around new people you want to have that overall appearance of just being classy elegant and put together there are other clothing selections out there that are comfortable that are casual that are soft something that you could just throw on and it will still look very classy and elegant so definitely check out one of my past videos that i gave you dolls it is called the top five clothing stores for feminine and classy clothing. Definitely check that out because I give you dolls some great clothing selections. And also on my blog, I give you dolls a couple of cute outfits. They're casual ones, dressy ones, dressy casual outfits on my blog. Overall, just make sure the clothing pieces that you're buying reflect who you want to look like. If you want to look more feminine and elegant, then definitely buy more feminine and elegant pieces. My fifth and final point that a classy woman never leaves her house wearing would have to be more so of forgetting, and that is the small details. Now, a classy woman, a feminine woman, what we don't do is forget the small details. And whenever you take that extra step, that extra time, just to make sure that, you know what? I look nice, I look presentable. That is my favorite word. If my husband is inviting over a friend, I'm like, please tell me beforehand, because of course I look fine, you know, but I wanna make sure that I look presentable, as in I want to make sure that I'm representing myself well, and I am representing my husband well. So I'm like, just, can I, can I just put on an extra little bit of blush? Whenever you take those extra steps to make sure, okay, you know what? My hair is done. I sprayed a little bit of perfume. My nails are done. Those small steps, they matter, they count. Those little details, it just matters. It makes you look better, it makes you feel better. And it makes you feel like you're taking care of yourself. That's something about being feminine. We are caretakers, we are loving. We love to take care of others. We also need to love to take care of ourselves. That is where our confidence comes from, a part of our confidence come from. So I would definitely encourage you. So I hope that you dolls enjoyed this episode. I gave you dolls some five great points that classy women never leave the house wearing. If you are doing some of these things, I completely get you. 
we all get into it. So I'm just encouraging you so you could be your best classy and feminine self. Like I said, there will be, of course, another blog post to complement this video. That blog post will have more details, more outfit ideas, just more different suggestions personally by me. So thank you dolls so much for joining me in this episode. Don't forget to subscribe down below. I post every week here on my channel and also on my blog. So thank you dolls so much and I will catch you all in my next video.